Hello, everybody. It is Monday, November the 3rd, and this is a special edition of the Friday webcast on a Monday because, you know, Monday. Uh, no, I'm doing this to explain a little bit of what we're going to do tonight for homework because it is slightly very much out of the norm of what we normally do. Um, first things first, reminder, tomorrow there is no school. Don't come to school tomorrow. Everyone will be voting. School will be closed. Thank you very much. Number two, homework. Okay, um, we are beginning to design and build our Rube Goldberg machines. If you don't know what a Rube Goldberg machine, just think of the uh, Wile E. Coyote Roadrunner movies where the coyote knocks down a whole bunch of stuff to capture the Roadrunner. Those are Rube Goldberg machines. Have your son or daughter explain it to you because they should ought to know what one is by now. Um, we basically have three simple steps. Uh, one, begin the research phase and end the research phase. Uh, for once, I am actually telling them to go watch YouTube videos. Watch Rube Goldberg YouTube videos, not those Minecraft things that they always sit and watch. Um, looking at the videos, not only for, wow, that's really cool, but looking at individual segments of those machines and saying, hey, I can do that. And sketching, drawing, outlining, grabbing, and building said segment. Um, two, planning. They need to make a diagram using their worksheet. Worksheet. Uh, using the worksheet here, they need to draw to scale as best as they can. I get it. I get it. Each square represents one inch. Measure out what you're looking at. Draw it out as best as you can. This is to scale as to the space on top of their desktop, which will be the surface that they'll be building the Rube Goldberg machines on. On the back is the floor. This is bonus space. They do not have to use the floor, but they're more than welcome to transfer the momentum down to the floor underneath their desk, have it go and do a bunch of stuff here, and then go back up to the top of their desk, and then transfer the momentum on to the next desk and the next person. There is also a diagram here where they can plan out what they're going to do along the side of uh, the, the desk as well, how they're going to get that thing to go up and down. Uh, and there should actually be a measurement right here as to how, how tall uh, their desk is from the ground up so that they can make measurements accordingly. After they're done diagramming, the final stage is to gather and build said Rube Goldberg machine at home. But we don't have a desk at home. No, but you have the measurements. The desktop is uh, 17 and a half inches by 23 and a half inches. Using masking tape, that little blue painter's tape, whatever you got, measure out an area on the floor. I'm trying to draw a box in the air and it's not working very well. Measure out the area and then build it. Will it work? Should it work with a little more tweaking and a little help? I'm all right with helping. That's what I'm here for. Um, bring in what they need to build and construct to fill in the space of uh, uh, the top of their desk at the very least. They will need to include uh, four different simple machines and a host of other stuff. This will be attached with another worksheet that I haven't printed out yet but I will. And I will send that home with them as well to help them gather resources as well as a few suggestions on how to go over and above things that they can do to improve their grade and get great big huge points and numbers and stuff. So all of that being said, um, this is fun. Have fun. Don't spend any money. You are not to go shopping. You are not to go out and buy a whole bunch of stuff. No money is to be spent. Gather stuff and things around the house, okay? Recycling, so to speak. Uh, also, no battery operated anything. Everything has to be moving on its own accord. No motorized stuff. Uh, springs are good, though. You can use a spring. I'll let you use a spring. That's one of those surprise me things, but that's only if you watch the video. So, hey, bonus. Um, that's all I got, everybody. Have a wonderful night. No school tomorrow for Election Day. Have a wonderful day off, and have fun designing your Rube Goldberg machine. And we will be debuting this next Monday for our STEM day. Uh, oh, and that reminds me. If there's any parents that want to come in and help out, love to have you on next Monday, uh, starting the very first in the morning and going until about 10, 30, 11-ish. Um, thanks all. Shoot me an email if you can join us. We'll talk to you soon. Bye.